Hello, hello, good evening, guys. Uh, hello, good evening, guys. Uh, are you there? Uh, hello, good evening. Uh, my name is Rene. Once again, we will try to explain or review uh, Unit 3 tonight, okay? So thank you so much for being on time. Uh, I see here Claudia, David, um, Russell Carmen como oyente, Saveda, Carla, Joseph Derrick, Marvin, thank you so much for being on time. Okay, so today we will uh basically review the unit three. All right, so we're gonna be practicing, you know, the information that we already know about uh the topics that we already checked. Right, so vamos a verificar, vamos a revisar lo que es la unidad tres y uh, ver detalles, dudas, sacar dudas y para poder ver, para poder entender lo que es. Excuse me. Uh, la unidad tres. Okay, so first to the first, let me share uh, my screen. Let me know if you are able to see what I'm checking right now. Give me one second. Let's see. Are you able to see it? Yes? Yes. Okay, excellent, excellent. Yes, excellent, very good, very good. Thank you so much. Um, okay, no, no, not a problem, Marvin. Okay, dry safe, okay? So relax, okay? No se preocupe. All right, so now uh, let's just uh, complete or double check our motivation part, okay? So let's repeat now today. Well, not a problem. Today, today, you're welcome. Today is Monday, right? Or Tuesday? What day is today? Monday. Monday today Monday. is Monday. Monday what? Monday what? Monday 13. 13. 13, no, no, 13, no, 13. Remember, TH. Acuérdese de suavizar, de suavizar la T y la H con su lengua hacia arriba, ¿verdad? 13, 13. All right, 13. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, so let's repeat motivation. Motivation. Mm, a little better, a little better. Okay, try try one more time, okay? Motivation, like the, like the way you want it, like the way you want to learn, because tonight we will learn a lot of information. So let's repeat, motivation. 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 Excellent, very good. Uh, sounds better, okay? So why we need to be motivated? ¿Por qué tenemos que estar motivados? Porque usted es la razón de lo que usted está elaborando, okay? Y el quote de esta noche es el siguiente. Let me read it for you. Uh, first, and then we will uh, review or repeat the information together, okay? So give me one second. It says, motivation is the fool. Discipline is the fire. One more time. Motivation is the fool. Me one second. Motivation. One second. One second. Just a moment. Vamos a... Cuando hay dudas en la pronunciación, remember, we need to check what? We're gonna check our translator tool, right? Translator their tool. Okay, so which is in this case. Okay, translator tool. One second. All right. So vamos a ver cómo se dice. Fuel. Fuel. Pero este está en español, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver en inglés. Fuel. Fuel. All right. Fuel. 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 All right. Fuel. So now, fuel. Uh huh. Okay. Now let's get back on track. Let's see over here. All right. Motivation is the fuel. Discipline is the fire. Let's repeat everybody. Motivation is the fuel. Motivation is the fuel. Is the fuel. Discipline is the fire. Discipline, Discipline is, the is the fire. All right. So what did that mean, uh, uh, Coach? What did that mean? Oh, well, let me tell you. Uh, apparently, if she, uh, as you can see, this is así, ¿verdad? La motivación es la gasolina, pero la disciplina es el fuego. So what we have to do, you need to have discipline. I mean, you need to have a motivation and discipline. And the motivation would be the fuel. All right? So, por eso le digo que si usted está, cuando yo le digo, repita motivation, usted me dice, motivation. 
motivation. No, le falta, le falta fuel, le falta la gasolina, le falta el, el, ¿cómo se llama? El gas, ¿verdad? Fuel. Ok, entonces necesita echarle ganas, ¿verdad? Y la disciplina, ¿cuál es la disciplina que tenemos que tener? All right, so being on time, participate in classes, eh, means that you need to make, uh, you need to ask questions if you, if it's possible, ask me as much as you can, <coughs> excuse me, as much as you can, you can ask the questions you want, you, you, uh, the questions you need, okay? So motivation is the fuel, discipline is the fire, okay? Remember, la disciplina es el fuego. ¿Cuál es la disciplina? Que usted va a ir acorde de, como debe de ser, okay? Very good. So now let's uh, just double check this and Let's repeat one more time. Motivation is the fuel. Motivation is the fuel. Motivation is the fuel. Discipline is the fire. Discipline, Discipline is, is the, fire. the fire. Thank you very much. Very good, very good. Okay, let's see. Uh, Carla, good evening. Uh, could you please read this after I read it? I'm going to read it first, and then you will be my next uh, participant. Okay, I mean, my next uh, volunteer. Okay, so please... Splash, splosh, when the dog in the wash. Come on, let's go. Easy. Please, splash, splosh, when the dog in the wash. Okay. Let's see. Oh, just a Derek. Go ahead. Read it for me, please. Please, splash, splosh, when the dog in the wash. In the wash. Okay. Uh, Soveda, please go ahead. Please, splash, splosh, when the dog in the wash. 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 Very good. Very Wash. Good. Wash. Claudia, please go ahead. Yes, please. Splash. Splash when they do in the wash. Very good. Elmer, please go ahead. Splash. Splash. Splash when they do in the wash. Excellent. David, go ahead. Please. Splash. Splash when they do in the wash. Okay. So let's see. Splish, more ahead. Splish, ¿qué más dice? Splish, splash, splosh, splosh, went, went, the dog, in the wash, the dog, in, the in wash. the wash, in the wash. Very good. Okay, let's see. Vamos a ver. Splish, splash, splash went the dog in the wash. Excellent. All right. So just double check all the time. If you're not able, I mean, if you're not quite sure, si usted no está seguro de la pronunciación que usted cree que tal vez la dijo mal, no se preocupe. Acuérdese que hay que utilizar el traductor. All right. Ese no es ningún crimen. Eso es una herramienta que lo tiene que tener todo el tiempo. Yo la utilizo en mi trabajo. Por el día de la mañana yo lo utilizo, ahí lo tengo. Por cualquier cosa, pues, yo escucho y veo cómo se, se pronuncia esa palabra, ¿verdad? Eso no es ningún delito. All right, so let's see. Uh, vamos a ver quién más está por acá. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Daniel, please, read that for me. Please, splash, splash, when the dog in the wash. Thank you. Jocelyn, go ahead. Okay, Jocelyn is not there. Laura, please, go ahead. Laura Raquel. Never read it. Uh, it's please, it's please, splash, splash, when the dog in the wash. In the wash. Okay, very good. Let's see. Uh, one second. All right, William Alonso, please, go ahead. It's please, splash, splash, when the dog is in the wash. Excellent. So why we are uh, basically uh, why we are practicing tongue twisters? Why? It's because remember that I told you at the beginning of these classes, right? That we have our tongue, nuestra, nuestra lengüita está enrolladita, verdad? Y tiene que fluir, fluir. Remember, let me, le, déjeme preguntarle, ¿cuántos de ustedes han hecho el ejercicio que le dije yo la vez pasada? Que agarraran un libro, cualquier libro de cualquier índole, pero en inglés, obvio, y que lo pasaran que pasaran practicando por lo menos una media hora leyendo lo que lo, lo que era pero le, eh, lo tenía que lo tenía que leer usted rápido cuánto lo han hecho Bianes Bianes mi teacher very good very good very good Me también teacher 
con uno, con dos, it, me alegro, me alegro, it, porque it, you are uh, following, you are following instructions. Usted está siguiendo instrucciones, y esa es la disciplina, ser disciplinado. All right, very good. I'm reading, I'm reading Angela, Angela's Hs. Very good, very good. All right, so yo le recomiendo... I, I read in El Principito, estoy leyendo. <laughs> excellent, excellent, very nice, very nice. The Little Prince, right? All right, so lo motivo que todos y todas, ¿verdad? Este, pongan ese, ese aporte para usted mismo. Y créame que va a avanzar. Esa es parte de la disciplina, va a avanzar. All right, y de igual manera lo felicito por el sacrificio que está haciendo aquí. Okay, Jenny, please read that for me. La vi ahí a Jenny, creo que se fue. Se fue. Hi, teacher. Hello, good evening, Jenny. Could you please read that for everybody? Uh, splish, splash, splosh, when the dog in the wash. In the wash, very good. Andrea, please, go ahead. Andreita, are you there? Andrea Mariana Garcia Torres. She's not there. Okay, very good, guys. Very good. Okay, so remember, you need to practice, practice, make the master. Remember, we need to practice uh, as much as you practice is basically what you are going to learn. You will learn a lot of information. You will learn pronunciation. You will have a, a lot of knowledge. Usted va a aprender pronunciación y va a tener mucho conocimiento. Cuando usted lee... Como le dije yo la vez pasada, a veces nos ponemos a leer, aunque no entienda lo que esté, lo que esté este, practicando, ¿verdad? Al, al momento de la leída, usted solo repita, lea lo rápido, lo más rápido que pueda, pero lo que yo quiero es que su lengüita empiece a fluir. Ok, very good. Vamos a verificar los uh, class adjectives from last night, I mean, from last class, right, last week. Ok, so, last adjective, I mean, last uh class adjective from last class that we had last i mean last week all right so it says like this participants participants will be able to talk about activities using present continuous all right so usted ahorita en este momento ya está habilitado no capacitado verdad capacitado en teoría al menos decirme unas tres dos oraciones aplicando o, o a Sí, aplicando lo que es el present continuous, donde usted me va a hablar acerca de actividades usando el present continuous. Yo le pregunto, Elmer, dígame una oración aplicando el present continuous. I'm, I'm starting right now. I am starting right now. Ok, ok, very good, very good. All right, so uh, let's see, uh, Carla, tell me a, a sentence where you apply or where you mention present continuous. Go ahead. We cooking. We who? cooking right now. Who? Cook. Who? Ah, who? Usted solo me dijo, we cooking, but who? O sea, cook. acuérdese que ahí le falta, le falta algo. Le falta algo para completarla. Está bien, está bien. Yo tengo la idea, pero le falta algo para que se, comple se complemente correctamente esa oración. Le falta algo. Porque cómo, cómo, me va, cómo sonaría eso si yo solo le digo cocinando. O sea, le falta, ¿qué le falta? We are cooking right now we are cooking right now what is this we are cooking right now excellent very nice uh david tell me a sentence uh with a present continuous mm, he is drinking drinking uh, coffee while make he's he's he is he's drinking coffee uh -huh. He's drinking coffee while Mike. Creo que Mike leche, leche trato de decir. Oh, milk. 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 Repeat. Uh, milk. 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 No, one more time. Milk. Milk. Mm, por ahí va, por ahí va. Acuérdense que la primera, segunda, <laughs> tercera, la cuarta, la quinta, la sexta le va a salir. Otra vez. Milk. 
Merk. No. Melk. Merk. Melk. Merk. Merk. No, otra vez. One more Merk. time. Melk. Merk. Very good. Very good. Merk. Excellent. Very good. Very good. All right. So, okay, let's see. Claudia, tell me a sentence with a uh, present continuous, please. They are he, he, eating pizza. They are eating pizza. Eating pizza. They are eating pizza. Jenny, please go ahead. A donde, teacher, ¿cómo fue? Uh, tell me, tell me a sentence with a present continuous. Mm, the, I, am, mm -hmm. I am watch, watching TV. I am watching TV. Acuérdense que tratemos de ser un poquito más específicos. Está bien, está bien. Yo lo entendí. Se entiende. Está, está excelente. Todas las oraciones que más están más que excelentes. Un complement. Un, un, un complement. Un complement. Así, digamos, no. usted dice, I am watching I am TV watching with my TV. family. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. uh, and my home. I am watching TV at... Uh, Yeah, in, my, home, in my in my house. Oh, in my cuarto, in my... I, I am watching TV in my room. My mm -hmm. room. Excellent. Very good, very good. Let's see who else is here. Uh Kerber, Kerber, uh Jocelyn, are you there? I am practicing. Okay. Um, of my daily routine. I am what could you please repeat that one more time? I'm sorry. I am practicing. Practicing. Uh -huh. No se consigue. Uh -huh. I am I am practicing. Okay, my, my I am practicing with my English with my English class or no 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 lo entendí muy bien. My daily routine. Oh, I am practicing with my daily routine. ¿Qué, qué me quieres dar a entender? Perdón. In, en en español, díganme la oración en español, uh, Jocelyn, si no es mucho molesto. Aquí yo estoy practicando mi rutina ya. En inglés. Okay. Se, oye, se oye con interferencia, no se oye muy bien la, su, su información. Ustedes le escuchan bien a Jocelyn, tal vez solo soy yo. Yo le escucho bien. Yo no le escucho, lo, 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 lo oigo con eco. Ella dice que está practicando la rutina diaria. Oh. I am practicing my daily routines. I am practicing my daily routines. Okay, very good. As long as you mention, remember the ING or the gerund. Acuérdense de que a veces en las, ¿cómo se llama? En los puntos gramaticales, grammar points are kind of confused, all right? Sometimes. But if you understand how to use grammar points, you are able to talk like the way you want or like the way we want that or like, or like the way we are looking for okay si usted se sabe los puntos gramaticales ese usted está está hecho para poder hablar o para buscar como quiero o como queremos hablar en una mejor manera all right pero créame de que a veces uno se confunde y dice okay el present continuous es el mismo present progressive es el mismo ing es el mismo gerund Sí y no, acuérdense que eso lo vimos la vez pasada, ¿verdad? Que tuvimos ahí este, unos, unos detalles, los, los, los desglosamos y dijimos que aparentemente sí es lo mismo, pero cambiaban parte de la, ¿cómo se llama? De la estructura, ¿ok? So, el next eh, topic de esta noche, let's see, vamos a ver, ok, el next, uh, I'm sorry, el next class objective, For this lovely night, would be participants will be able to talk about temporary situations using present continuous. All right, temporary situations is basically. Ya, ya lo vimos, verdad? ¿Cuáles son eh, cuando decíamos temporary situations? Lo que me acaban de decir, porque casi la mayoría me dijo right now, mm -hmm. at this moment, right? Yes. All right. So temporary situation is like, a, okay, I am talking with you, Mr. Escamilla. I am talking with you today. I am talking with you just right now. I am talking or I need to go now. Entonces, esas son las temporary situations, all right? Temporary situations, okay? So now let me just share some information here. Vamos a verificar algo más acá. 
Déjame saber si está habilitado a, a ver lo que yo estoy observando. Hello. Now you see. Okay, very good. Okay, so the present continuous tense. So look. Está bien detallado, ¿verdad? Es el, el ING, el bird to be, and that's it. All right, so let's repeat. I am giving classes right now. I am, I am giving classes right, right now. now. My mother is working now. My, my mother, my is, mother is working now. now. Very good, very good. The students are paying. The students, the students are paying. paying. Si se fija esta, esta oración, the students are paying, paying what? Ahí le faltó algo, ¿verdad? No. Paying, ¿el qué? Aquí está Atención. la Attention, right? At this moment, se da cuenta, ¿verdad? Pensé que me iba a decir que le faltaba otra cosa, pero no, ¿verdad? Se lleva la secuencia, ¿verdad? El punto está hasta acá, dice. Ok, let's repeat. The students are paying attention at this moment. Uh, the students are, student are, student are, are paying attention at this moment. At this moment. All right, so, like the, like the way you are doing at this, at this moment, right? So, usted está poniendo atención en este momento. Let's repeat one more time. The students are paying. The, the students, students are paying. paying. The are paying. Attention at this moment. Attention, attention at, at this moment. moment. Excellent. Very good, very good. Okay, let's see. Volvemos a verificar lo que estábamos viendo la vez pasada. Affirmative, play, affirmative way would be I am I'm playing, right? So, está la contracción y está lo infinitivo, ¿ok? You are, we are, they are playing. He is, she is, all right, and on and on and on, all right? So, are we clear with this? Remember, yes. en este caso, lo único que cambia, pues yo sé que toda esta información es nueva para muchos, ¿verdad? Uno ya la conoce, ya la manejan. Y a veces, como le repito, usted ni cuenta se va a dar when you are practicing or when you are talking, automatically you will have the, you know, the information in your, in your mind and, uh, I mean, and you will be talking a lot of information from your mouth, of course, right? So, but automatically you will, you will have those, uh, those words, you know, you will, you will mention those words properly, Okay. O sea, eso ya es así como que por, por inercia usted va a estar hablando. O sea, no se preocupe de que, Dios mío, tanta información, voy a hablar en, en afirmativo en este momento. No. Si yo le digo en, uh, en este instante, uh, Sobeida, what are you doing at this moment? What would be your answer? en este momento. Eso me está preguntando. Exacto, ajá, ajá. ¿Cuál sería su respuesta? I am studying English. Yes and no. All right, so verifiquemos bien la, las respuestas. Está bien, la contestó bien, pero le hizo falta lo más importante. Right now. Eso y, y que ella me dijo, en, en, en vez de decir, I am a student, Right now, ¿qué, ¿qué sería? I am. El verbo es study, right? Studying. I am studying. Acuérdese. Um, I am okay. studying right now. Okay? ok. Very good. Very good. Acuérdese de eso. Siempre contestando como que yo le dijera, ¿qué está, qué está haciendo en este momento? Yo estoy comiendo. Yo estoy estudiando. Yo estoy observando. Yo estoy hablando. Lo mismo sería en español, ¿verdad? Like... I am studying. Si yo estoy tomando, por decir, agua, ¿verdad? Me si decía, mira, la botellita de agua. I am drinking water. All right, I am drinking water, ¿verdad? Si yo estoy con el, con el celular, que creo que todos estamos con el celular, ¿verdad? A la par. Estamos recibiendo la clase y estamos viendo el, el WhatsApp al mismo tiempo, ¿verdad? Pues espera, yo uh -huh. no, no, no miro. Que como que adivina, dice, dijeron por ahí, ¿verdad? Entonces, entonces yo estoy hablando, yo estoy hablando por teléfono. I am talking over the phone. I am texting over the phone. I am calling and etcétera, 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 ¿verdad? Entonces, uh, todo eso, acordémonos del ING. Ok, perfect, perfect, perfect. Vamos a ver. Ok, present continuous tense, ok. So, let's repeat, let's see. 
Um, Marvin, please, uh, are you able to, to talk now? Are you driving? No? Hello? Are you driving right now or are you home? Ya anda manejando o ya se está en la casa? Estoy manejando, pero estoy parqueado ahorita. Ah, ok, ok. Léame esta oración. Léame esta oración. Ok. Toda, toda. Is, is it playing football at the moment? No. He is not, he is running. All right, let's repeat it one more time. No, he isn't. No, he isn't. He's running. He's running. 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 Very good, very good, excellent. Much better, much better. All right, let's see. Uh, Joseph Derry, please read that for me, please. Is he playing football at the moment? No, he isn't. He is running. So, what did that mean? I mean, do you understand the question? I mean, yeah. Do you understand this question already, guys? Entienden esta pregunta? Yes, teacher. Se entiende, verdad? Así como qué le está diciendo él. Si le pregunto a, quiero ver. Vamos a ver, vamos a ver. Vamos a preguntar aquí a alguien más. A mi estimada Laura. Good evening. ¿Qué es lo que entendemos de esta pregunta, mi estimada? Yo sé que no es clase de traducción, pero solo quiero tener la seguridad que estamos entendiendo, please. Le pregunta que si él está jugando fútbol en ese momento. No, él, él no dice, él está corriendo. Excellent, very good, very good. Everybody's agree with Laura? Yes? Yes, I agree. Excellent, yes, okay. we are. Excellent, very good. Let's see. Uh, okay, Laura, please help me with this, uh, with this sentence, please. Pero de, empecemos desde arriba. What is she doing? She is driving a picture at the moment. Excellent, very good. Carla, please go ahead, read that for me. What What is she doing? She is drawing a picture at the moment. Very good, very good. Okay, let's see. Uh, Elmer, please go ahead. What is she doing? She is drawing a picture at the moment. Excellent. Let's see. Um, so there. William, please go ahead. Be my guest. Um, what is she doing? She's drawing a picture at the moment. All right. Very good. Let's see. Um, Andrea, please go ahead. What is you doing? She very is good. drawing a picture at the moment. Very good, very good. Okay, let's see. Uh, David. What is she doing? She is drawing, drawing, drawing a picture in the moment. At the moment, drawing. Re repeat, drawing. Drawing. Okay, excellent. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Drawing. All right, let's see. All right, let's read that. Read that for me, uh, Derek. Just a Derek. Yes. What is that many doing? It is quiet. All right, so repeat that one more time. What is Tweety doing? What is Tweety doing? Okay, remember that we need to sound as question, right? Eso que no se nos olvide. <clears throat> Tenemos que sonar como pregunta. What is Tweety doing? It's flying. All right, so, un tip que le, que le, que le, que le repito o que se lo puedo de, decir una a mil, mil veces, que no me voy a cansar, es que, y le va a servir, que tampoco ser dramático, ¿verdad? Pero trate de, so, trate de sonar. Uh, el inglés es un poco así como expresivo, ¿verdad? Y cuando nosotros hacemos, empezamos o seguimos los, los parámetros correctos, cuando estamos hablando, créame que usted va a aprender de una manera, una manera fenomenal, una manera excelente, la cual usted va a decir, wow, this is the way, this is the way that I'm talking, this is the way that I, that I, that I need, that I need to talk, this is the way that I want to talk all the time, ¿verdad? Porque El inglés es bien expresivo. Ok, very good, excellent. Let's see. Vamos a ver otro por acá. 
All right, read that for me. Uh, let's see, uh, Carla. What is David doing at the moment? He is playing football. Very good, very good. He's playing. He's he's playing. He's Hola, playing he's, football. Excellent. Cuando mire el apostrofe aquí de una sola vez, verdad? De, así de de una. Usted dice he's. Cuando está is, usted lo dice. He is playing. Por aquí he's playing football. All right. Very good. Let's see. Read that for me, Jenny. Go ahead. What is David doing? At the moment, she's playing football. Okay, hold on one second. Just a moment. Hold on one second. I have a problem over here. Hello, hello, can you hear me? Hello. Yes, hello, I'm sorry. Tuve un bajón de internet, I'm sorry. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, vamos a ver, let's see. Claudia, no, me, please read that for me. What is David doing? At the moment, he is playing football. Excellent, excellent. Very good, very good. <clears throat> okay, let's see. All right, one more time, right, guys? We have over here the, the verb ing spelling rules, right? So, esto es parte de la información que usted tiene que manejar, ¿verdad? Esto es bien importante al momento de deletrear o de este... Uh, pronunciar esta palabra, ¿verdad? Entonces, si el, si el verbo acá es, por ejemplo, die, all right, so, si usted se fija, el ending, el ending part de die es IE, en inglés would be IE, right? IE, die. Pero si queremos decir muriendo, vamos a cambiar vamos a cruz, vamos a omitir la IE o la IE por la letra Y, que es en inglés Y, right? Dying. Repeat, dying. 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 Okay. dying. All right, so very dying. good. Very good. The same thing with lie. Repeat, lie. 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 All right, so now repeat, lying. 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 All right, so. No, so you see lying is uh, mintiendo. Let's see. Um, vamos a ver quién puede ayudar por acá. Mr. Mr. Elmer, could you please tell me. tell me a sentence with the verb, I mean, with the ing, verb ing, lying. Lying. Mm -hmm. Tell my sister, me. my sister is lying to me. My sister is lying to me. All the times. Porque suena mejor, my, my sister is lying to me all the times. Very good, very good. Let's see. Uh, Jenny, please tell me a sentence where you mentioned dying. Dying, acuérdese que es su muriendo. Okay, a sentence... Pero armémosla así, tratemos de armarlas en el aire, así como que. All right, so ya sabemos que dying es muriendo, solo necesita subject, 
verb and complement, right? So, ya le dimos la primera parte. Di uh, dying. Go ahead. No sé si se podría... I am dying... Angry? I am dying no. angry. ¿Se está muriendo de enojada o qué? Eh, ah, no, hungry, es que me confundo. Hungry con angry. Hambre. <ríe> Hambrienta. Oh. Me estoy muriendo de hambre. Mm, bueno, ahí, ahí no sí sé se, si se podría. No. Ahí, pero, pero buen punto, buen punto, porque ahí es donde entra, entra que caemos nosotros en el, en la, ¿cómo se dice? En, a españolizar, estamos españolizando, ¿verdad? Eh, y ahí le voy a hacer un paréntesis también, o sea, yo le entiendo, me estoy muriendo del hambre, entonces, en inglés, cuando usted tiene hambre, usted dice, oh my God, I'm hungry. ¿Verdad? Y se toca la pancita, ¿verdad? Porque le está, le, le está rugiendo ahí la, la tripita, ¿verdad? Que le... Y no ha comido, ¿verdad? Pobrecito, pobrecita, no ha comido. Pero en, lo, eh, en el... Aprovechamos ahorita. Está en New Teacher. No, yo ni lo veo. Can you hear me now? Teacher. Are you there? Yes, yes I'm here. I'm here. Pero no lo vemos. <laughs> Miran, no. No. Yes, yes. No. 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 Yes. No, teacher. No, teacher. All right, pero me, me pueden escuchar. Yes. Yes, yes. yes teacher. ¿Cuánto, ¿Cuánto me pueden ver? Es que yo creo que es la, la señal que se cayó. ¿Qué? Ahorita sí. Yo sí lo veo. Yo sí lo veo. Ok, ahorita se me ha quedado estática Jenny. Se quedó así estática. Quiero ver. Bueno, anyways. Very good. So, lo que les estaba diciendo, guys, les estaba comentando al, al ejemplo que decía Jenny, ¿verdad? Le, ella decía de que se está muriendo del hambre, entonces hay un un, uh, ¿cómo se llama? Un adjetivo, el cual usted lo dice de esta manera, I'm starving. O sea, I am hungry. Starving es como hambri hambriento. Ahí estoy hambrienta, ajá, estoy hambrienta, I'm starving. O sea, es que se come toda la sandía, pues vaya. En ese, ahorita en ese momento se come toda la sandía cuando, cuando está, que dice, I'm starving, I'm starving. Oh my goodness, I'm really starving, all right? So, pero I'm hungry es, tengo hambre, es así sencillamente, I'm hungry, ¿verdad? Very good, very good observation. Uh, Entonces Jenny. le digo otra, otra oración. Sí, dígame otra. Uh -huh. como, the zombies are dying. Yeah, the zombies are dying uh, in the darkness or at night. The zombies are dying are in the darkness. Darkness, darkness yes, in the darkness. Ah, okay. Uh -huh, in the darkness, very good. Let's see, vamos a ver. Permítame, quiero ver si puedo compartir ya. Ok. All right, acuérdese de que esto es prácticamente solo para los verbos este, verificando. Estos son unos, ¿verdad? Este ya es pura gramática, pura gramática, puntos, uh, puro uh, grammar points, all right? So the same thing would be we delete. But now let's see, uh, Claudia, tell me a sentence where you apply uh, dying. Mr. Mark, Claudia. Um, no sé, teacher, dying, muriendo, okay. Okay. o mintiendo. Cualquiera, diga, una, una de dos. Dying or lying? Uh, she is lying. She is lying. Um, today. She is lying today. Very good. Excellent. Excellent. All right. So uh -huh. let's see. All right. So next, uh, next example or next uh, point, grammar point. It's the the words ending in letter E. Como por ejemplo, delete and compete. Let's repeat, delete. Delete. And compete. 
and, and compete. compete. Excellent. So re, uh, let's repeat delete, deleting. 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 Competing. Competing. All right. So very good. All right. So if you se fija solo, se cambió la E por el ING. Se quita, se omite la E y se le pone el ING. Deleting. All right. Deleting. Competing. All right. So. Next uh, grammar point ending with CVC. All right, CVC. All right, in este, este caso sería run, running. All right, so double N. So that means that we need to add a letter and, and an extra N. Al verbo run, que es correr, usted le va a agregar la, la, una extra N y el ING. Sería running, no run. running, no running. Así con running. como running, como con A, running. Running, running. Excellent, excellent. A stop would be the same thing, right? So stop, stopping, all right? So let's repeat, run, mm -hmm. running. Run, running. Running. Stop, stopping. Stop, stopping. Stopping. All right, very good, excellent. So let's uh, double check the next, right? The ending syllable, all right, so would be the next, all right? So, en este caso, el verbo es refer, referring. Let's uh, repeat, refer, referring. Refer, referring. 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 Okay, very good. So, aquí solamente también se va a agregar una letra R al, al verbo referring, right? Referring y el ing. Let's repeat, uh -huh. omit. Omit. Omitting. Omit. Omitting. 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 Remember, Omitting. double T. All right. So next ending okay. syllable would be the kind of like the same thing, right? So let's repeat happen. Happen. Happening. Happen. Happening. Happening. O open. 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 Opening. Open. Excellent. Opening. Excellent. Very good. Very good. So este solamente es un, es un repaso. Recuerdense que estamos haciendo un repaso de la... ¿Cómo se llama? De la unidad, eh, unidad 3. Vamos a ver. Uh -huh. Aquí hay unas palabras que usted las puede identificar de la igual manera. Mire. So, make ING forms of each verb given. All right. So, so let's repeat. Begin. Begin. Beginning. 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 Rob. 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 Robin. 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 Listen. 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 Listening. 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 Swim. 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 Swimming. 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 Lie. 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 Lying. 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 Study. 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 Studying. Starting. Starting. Happen. 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 Happening. Happening. Happen. Happen. Happening. Very good. Next. Get getting. Get getting. Getting. Get getting. Get, getting. Get, getting. One more time. Get getting. Get, get, get getting. getting. Use using. Use, use using. Using. Use, admit admitting. Admit admitting. admitting. Try trying. Try, try, try. Uh, decide, deciding. Decide, deciding. deciding. Come, coming. Come, come coming. coming. Put, putting. Put, putting. Put, putting. Put, putting. Excellent. Very good. Very good. All right. So remember that if you have any doubts, concerns, you know, complaints, try to double check this, right? So try to just, uh, Get in mind that every time that you are going to set, like, uh, for example, play, if you, if you te quiere decir como se dice jugando en inglés, usted solo le agrega el ING, en este caso, ¿verdad? en este contexto. Pero por eso hay que conocer los verbos, ¿verdad? A grosso mm -hmm. modo. Yo le sugiero y le vuelvo a repetir, apréndase al menos cinco semanal, para no ir a la carrera, vaya semanal, cinco verbos semanales pero bien aprendidos 
¿verdad? Y yo sé que todos tenemos la capacidad. Usted la tiene, yo la tengo, todos, ¿verdad? Lo que pasa es que necesitamos disciplina. Si usted no tiene disciplina, no va a haber, este, ¿cómo se llama? ¿Cómo decía el, el, el pensamiento de ahora? No va a haber ningún avance en su uh, aprendizaje. Ok, disciplina, usted se aprende cinco verbos. Porque de igual manera, if you are checking these verbs, all right, so probably we already know the meaning of each of them, right? Probably. Probably we don't know the meaning of Robin, all right? So uh, let's see, deciding, well, well that's, that's easy, all right? So to me, it's easy. Yeah. All right, so, but beginning, so what would be the meaning of beginning? Comenzar. No. Beginning. Beginning. Empezar. Ah, comenzando. Comenzando, exactly. exactly. Okay. What about Robin? Robin. Five, four, three, two, one. Boom. Explotó Robin. ¿Cuál es el meaning de Robin? Frotando, ¿no? Frotando, ¿verdad? Frotando. All right, listening. Escuchar. Escuchando. Lying. Mintiendo. Swimming. Mintiendo. Nadando. Nadando. Studying. Estudiando. Happening. Estudiando. Sucediendo. Getting. Obteniendo. Very, very good. Using. Usando. Usando. Ad admitting. Admitiendo. Admitiendo. Trying. Tratando. Intentando. Deciding. Decidiendo. Coming. Viniendo. And putting. Poniendo. Excellent, excellent. Very good. All right, so that's that's what I'm talking about, guys. All right, so if you already know the, the verbs, if you already know the meaning, so you should know, you should know, o sea, tampoco lo estoy como forzando. No, esto no se trata así, ¿verdad? Pero sí le estoy dando un poco de... Uh, ¿Cómo se llama? ¿Cómo se llama esta palabra? Se me ha olvidado, pero le estoy dando un poco que, que seamos más. Uh, lo, no es forzarlo, sino que le estoy dando más información para que usted pueda desarrollarse como, como, como un estudiante bilingüe, ¿verdad? Entonces, si usted ya sabe the meaning of begin, listening, lie, swimming, study, happen. All right, so if you, if you already know the meaning of those verbs, So you shouldn't have problems, right, to to create or to talk with somebody in front of you or next to you or around you, all right? So because this is the, the way that you will be, you know, creating the, the sentences, the words, all right? So the information, for example, let's see, let me talk with, um, uh, vamos a ver, Carla, all right, we are going to use these verbs all right so try to assume try to assume a, a conversation that we we'll, that we will have right now but we need to use these verbs okay so says acepta el reto si me entendió vamos a crear una, una conversación donde vamos a aplicar estos verbos all right so pero tratemos de usted me dice yo le digo usted me dice yo le digo pero vamos a hacer una conversación como que ya nos conocemos, ¿verdad? Ya nos conocemos y, y le vamos a dar vuelta a todos los verbos, all right? So, but I want you to you create the sentences, you know? Very good. I started, all right? I will start it for you, okay? So, all right. At the very beginning, uh, Carla, I show you that we need to be working. We need to be listening, you know, the English classes that you are taking with me. What do you think about it? Si no, si no puede, elijo a otro y después le da a usted. ¿Qué le parece? Ok, teacher. Bye. Okay. Mi estimado Elmer. Ok, so let me start it. Ok. All right, okay. Uh, Elmer. At the very beginning, okay. at the very beginning of these classes, remember that I told you that we need to be listening, working, paying attention because we need to learn to speak English. Do you remember? Yes, I remember. Okay. So, tell me about it. 
Tell me about it. What, what do you think? In the beginning of the class. Mm -hmm. Oh, in the beginning of the courses. Ok, creo que no, me, no, no hemos agarrado la, la idea. No, no. Vaya, la idea es esta. I didn't get you. Estamos, estamos asumiendo una conversación. Si usted se fija, yo ya, ya, ya utilicé beginning. Ya utilicé uh -huh. listening. Yes. Ok, entonces, viene Elmer y, 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 y empieza a hablar y dice, Ah, yes, teacher. You, you told us that we need to try every day. That we need to... Uh, yes, teacher, I got it. You got it now, right? Very good. Yes. Okay, let's go. Let me let me start it. All right, uh, Elmer, at the very beginning of this class, I remember that I told you that we need to be working, listening, because we need to learn to speak English, right? So we don't need to be lying ourselves. Okay, so what do you think about it, uh, Elmer? I think for... For the study English, mm -hmm. we need to we need to try. Okay. We need to try starting every day. Uh huh. We we need to to learn to listening. Uh huh. Let's let's uh let's ask uh, Carla. Maybe she has some ideas about it. Carla, what do you think? about the, the information that we are talking with Elmer. What do you think? I think um, I need studying English and mm -hmm. and practice and listening and talking. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, and we try and practice more. And we need to try. We need to try and we practice. We need to try and practice more. Practice more. Very good. I guess we are getting a lot of information every day. All right. So, so but we need to put more, we need to put more effort more uh, discipline and our information that we are developing with Mr. I mean, with our classes, because we need to admit that sometimes we don't, we don't practice, we don't study. What do you think about it, uh, Joseph Derek? Um, during the weekend. I'm sorry. Um, during the weekend, yeah. But coming in practice, my English admitting in the night. Mm -hmm. I using my practice in the tourism. Uh huh. Okay. And. Yeah. All right, very good, very good, very good. Let's see. Uh Jenny. Uh what do you think about it? We we we've been talking, we've been talking at, at the very beginning, we we've, we've been talking about English practices, right? So Carla already mentioned that we need to try and work more in order to learn to speak English. All right. So what do you think about it? Tell me. I'm not English. Ah, <laughs> why, why are you laughing? All right, so, but, ¿se dan cuenta? ¿Se dan cuenta, mis niños y mis niñas, que de esta manera usted va a concretar ideas? O sea, prácticamente lo que estoy haciendo yo es creando un escenario, ¿sí? Un escenario en el cual usted está asumiendo, está, asum está asumiendo eh, una conversación que no existe. Pero lo único que quiero yo es de que usted 
me utilice todos estos verbos que están acá, lo, lo que más pueda, lo que más pueda, hablando acerca de el inglés, acerca de las clases de inglés, ¿verdad? Y así se va creando usted un escenario tras otro escenario. Cuando ya viene usted a, a, a la vida real, a la, ya, a la vida real, y ya empieza, usted dice, se le va a hacer fácil, ¿all right? Because I shouldn't be talking in Spanish. No debería estarles hablando en español. Pero yo quiero que usted me entienda al 100, ¿verdad? Porque si yo solo paso hablando inglés, mañana, mañana solo van a ver, quiero ver, unos siete en la clase. ¿Qué va a decir? No, me va a decir, yo no le entendí nada, no le, no, no le entendí nada, es maestro, va a decir, ¿verdad? Solo inglés, 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 pero I, I shouldn't be talking in Spanish. I should be, you know, I... I have to speak English most of the time with you guys. Otherwise, you won't learn to speak English, ¿ok? Como dice, por el oír viene la fe, ¿verdad? Entonces, usted tiene que poner atención, atención, ¿qué es lo que está diciendo? Si ya sabemos que admitting es admitiendo, que trying es intentando, deciding es decidiendo, coming, viniendo, putting, poniendo, etcétera, etcétera, etcétera. Entonces usted ya puede crear una ya puede crear una conversación. Por ejemplo, uh, podríamos ver con, continuar con todos. A mí me hubiera gustado agarrar a uno cada uno, ¿verdad? O no sé si usted se anima a seguir la conversación. Le doy la oportunidad para que se, se lance en este momento. Any volunteer, a volunteer or victim, victim or volunteer. Alguien que quiera participar nuevamente, creando una conversación, por lo menos que me mencione like three verbs. It could be the infinity verb, or you can mention the ing verb as well. So, anybody else want to participate? Don't be shy. No, no tenga miedo. No tenga miedo. No sea penoso. Si se equivoca, se va a equivocar acá. ¿Verdad? Pero allá afuera, no quiero que se me equivoque. ¿Verdad? Porque ya, 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 ya veo yo que le digan a uno, o sea, ¿cómo? ¿Qué dijiste? ¿Verdad? Entonces, any volunteer? No volunteer? Ah, pues no hay voluntario, yo lo voy a elegir. Vamos a ver, quiero ver. Uh, vamos a ver, mi licenciado William Alonso. Are you there? Yes. Okay, so try to, exp try to tell me, uh, William, or, tr or let's try to have a conversation, right? So let's talk about English classes try to use like three or four verbs that you see at this moment. Can you do that? Okay, right now uh, I'm listening the class because I clean in my room and I try to pay attention. Excellent. Um, but I I need to study English um use the forms the codex forms mm -hmm. and uh what more what else and and i admit i um i don't know okay excellent very good right on my class my class i like that okay david tell me try to do something all right so the la misma cosa the same thing Try to talk about English classes using these verbs. Go ahead, David. You can do it. Usando los verbos que están ahí. Sí, sí. Lo que usted lo, quiera. Lo que vaya. Eh, eh, I, I am always uh, rubbing my teddy. Eh, eh, because I need to have uh courage no sé cómo es coraje courage mm -hmm. uh, uh, yeah, I, and i decide decide deciding deciding if i learn because i be belay in in myself myself all right no. very good very good excellent excellent uh claudia please be my guest go ahead I am studying right now. 
en eh, listening eh, uh -huh. es que los demás verbos no sé qué, qué significan sí lo sabe si sí, lo acabamos de lo acabamos de decir sí lo sabe guys acuérdese de que para que no se le olvide para que no se le olvide y esto no no es no es cosa del otro mundo ahora ni me lo voy a tomar a mal pero acuérdese que si usted quiere aprendérselos siempre hay que tener un lapicero y un cuaderno verdad ya lo hubiera ido apuntando hubiera visto porque dijimos que era beginning comenzando verdad Robin era frotando, listening, escuchando, lying, mintiendo, swimming, nadando, studying, estudiando, happening, sucediendo, getting, eh, retomando o tomando, using, usando, admiring, admitiendo, trying, intentando, deciding, decidiendo, coming, uh, viniendo, putting, poniendo, ¿verdad? Entonces, por eso le digo yo, a veces tenemos lack of, no, no falta de conocimiento, porque eso no es eso, no es eso, no es falta de conocimiento, sino que, este, o tal vez sí, porque no practicamos los verbos. All right. You need to practice the verbs every single day. ¿Verdad? Porque así, yo le digo, para que se le haga más fácil, se le haga más fácil a usted tener una conversación, usted necesita usar los verbos. Quiero ver solo Elmer y William y no sé quién más me este me mencionaron conectores a la hora de a la hora de hablar a la hora de estar mencionando la información que estábamos uh, cuando yo les dije que ahí entabláramos una conversación o sea esa esa parte de los conectores espero que no se les olvide jamás a la hora de hablar por qué razón porque usted va a estar hablando eh, le llaman, en inglés le llaman mambling, o sea, que está como tartamudeando, se ha fijado que uno está así, uh, 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 pero es porque no tenemos, primero no tenemos los verbos, no tenemos los, ¿cómo se llama? Los conectores. Y eso no es culpa de nadie, solamente le estoy re, re, recapitulando lo que tiene que hacer usted, all right So, don't get me wrong, no me malinterprete. You need to practice more and believe it or, believe it or not, Tomorrow, your information, your English information will be better. You will be talking nicely. You will be talking, you know, with a great accent, with a great um, expressions. You will, you will be talking properly. Okay? So, very good. Not a problem. Not a problem. Okay, let's see. Vamos a ver. Ok, so exercises, so let's see. Entonces aquí usted mira, no sé si terminaron estos ejercicios. ¿Se recuerda que yo les dije que lo hicieran para que lo subieran al, 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 al ¿cómo se llama? Al portafolio, ¿se recuerda? ¿Verdad? O sea, siempre que yo le diga algo, apúntelo también, ¿verdad? Apúntelo, así como en la universidad. En la universidad solo llega un maestro y... Esto no es, no es universidad, ¿verdad? Don't get me wrong, all right? So, but I'm trying, I'm trying to tell you how you need, how you need to be taught. I mean, how you can be uh, studying or getting more information, you know, properly. No sé si usted ha estado en la universidad, ¿verdad? Porque hay unos catedráticos en la universidad que solo llegan a hablar. Y si usted apuntó, bueno. Y si no apuntó, bueno también. Y ya la, la próxima viene el examen. Y usted dice, no apunté nada, dice, ¿verdad? Entonces, así, usted tiene que ir apuntando las cositas y créame que usted va a ser un autodidacta, usted va a estar agarrando más información e información. Ok, so, let's repeat, admit. Teacher, yes. admit. Todos esos verbos hay que hacer como escribirlos así en, con el ING. Sí. Mire, este, Jenny, buena pregunta. Vaya, para que se le, cuando yo este, quiero que se me queden las cosas, y este le voy a este es un tip extra para ustedes, y yo creo que ya lo saben, ya está contestado acá, mire, y, y esto usted ya lo, ya lo tiene también, ya les mandé este, este archivo, ¿verdad? Ya lo tienen. Entonces, lo que usted va a hacer es prácticamente solo escribe, eh, reescribirlo, 
trate de, de apuntarlo en un cuaderno y viene usted y lo recríquerame que se le va a quedar, se le van a quedar. Usted dice, oh, sí, admit es admitting, answer is answering, break is, is bre uh, breaking, bring is bringing, buy is buying, build is building, clean is cleaning, come is coming, cut is cutting, cry is crying, etcétera, 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 ¿verdad? Y ahí está, ya tiene usted las fórmulas y ya lo va a ir identificando usted de la mejor manera. ¿Sí me explico? Ok. Porque ya están, ya están contestados. ¿Ve? Aquí están contestados ya. ¿ve? Entonces, no tiene que solamente es res, eh, transcri, transcribirlos prácticamente. All right. So, let's see. Uh, vamos a ver. Uh, Marvin, please, read that for me. Are you dry, teacher? Oh, are you driving? I'm sorry. My bad. Okay, uh, let's see. So, Veda, read that for me, please. I'll say, ¿qué me quiere decir? Oh, ¿qué me lo lea? Um, read that for me. They are dancing right new. Okay, one more time. They are dancing right they now. They are they are dancing right now dancing dancing dancing, dancing, dancing right now right now excellent que dice acá arriba actions that are happening at present right present. all right so actions that are happening at present okay so they are dancing right now let's repeat everybody they are dancing right now they are dancing, they are dancing, dancing, dancing right, right, now. right now excellent Temporary situations. They normally play tennis. Let's repeat. They play. They normally play tennis. They, they normally, normally, they play, normally tennis. play tennis. But this week they are skating. But, but this week, week they are, are, are skating. 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 Excellent. Let's see. Uh, yesterday it was very sunny. Yesterday, yesterday it was very sunny. Very sunny. Today it's raining more and more. Today, Today it's raining, raining more, more, and more, and more, more and more. Excellent, excellent. All right, future arrangements. Let's repeat future arrangements. Future arrangements. They are celebrating at Patty next week. Not next weekend, I'm sorry. They are they celebrating are a celebrating party next, next weekend. Next weekend. Excellent. Let's see. All right. So let's repeat the present continuous tense. Repeat the present continuous tense. In the present, the present continuous, continuous tense. tense. Time expressions, right? So remember the time expression. Let's repeat time expressions. Time yes. expression. expression. Okay, now. 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 At, at the moment. At, at the, the moment. 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 Today. 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 Nowadays. Nowadays. Now days. This week. This, this week. week. Okay, so si tienen el significado el significado de nowadays. Hoy en Nuevo día. día. En estos días, en este día, en estos días. Nowadays, en okay. estos días. Okay, very good. Okay, let's repeat. They are throwing snowballs now. They, they are throwing snowballs snowball now. Now. Very good. One more time. They are throwing snowballs now. They, they are throwing snowballs now. now. Excellent, excellent. All right, before we continue, let me just go ahead and pass the list real quick, okay? Just a moment. Let's see. Remember, you need to have your camera on if you want to be, um, I mean, if you want to complete your assistant, I mean, yeah, your assistant tonight, okay? Let's see. Just a moment.
Vamos a ver. All right, guys, uh, just repeat. I mean, just say uh, present. I'm here, and that's all. You already know that, right? So, Adriana Ernestina Contreras Godinez. Adriana Ernestina Contreras Godinez. She's not here. Okay. A ver. No creo que está como oyente, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver. All right. Andrea Mariana Garcia Torres. Present teacher. Thank you, miss. Uh, Angela Andres Jorge. Angela Andres Jorge. She's not here. Claudia Noemi Carcamolara. Present. Thank you. Uh, Daniel Armando Rivera. Present. Thank you. Elmer Alexander Tejada Samayoa. Um, Elmer Antonio Hernandez Chicas. Present. Thank you. Eric Alejandro Paul Flores. Gladys Teresita Díaz Álvarez. Gladys Teresita Díaz Álvarez. Uh, Jenny Raquel Figueroa Samara. Present. Jocelyn Geraldine Evangelista Castro. Present, teacher. Thank you, miss. Jose David Seneca Padilla. Present, teacher. Carla Melissa Martinez Cruz. Present, teacher. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Laura Raquel Navarrete Rivera. Present, teacher. Thank you, miss. Uh, Mario Roberto Alfaro Peña. Mario Roberto Alfaro Peña. It's not here. Okay, let's see. Rosa del Carmen Rojas Perez. This is not here, too. And Sobeida, uh, perdón, Rosa del Carmen Rojas, de, Rojas Perez. Sobeida de la Cruz Méndez de Rivera. Present. Thank you. Teresa de Jesús García Coto. Teresa de Jesús García Coto. William Alonso Rubio Moreno. Present. Thank you. Uh, Marvin Wilfredo Martinez Kirby. Present, teacher. Thank you. Nixon uh, Jose Derek Lemus Mejia. Present, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay, so if I didn't mention your name, let me double check the, the chat, right? Let's see. One second. Vamos a ver, aquí tengo tres en el chat. Ahí está Rosa, okay. Adriana y Eric. Rosa and Adriana y Eric. Okay, hold on. Vamos a ver, permítame. All right, very good, Adriana. Okay, nice down. Okay, very good. All right, guys, let me double check. One more ten. Uh, one more time. I'm sorry. Let's see. Give me one second. All right, let's review this. Give me one second. Ya vamos a continuar con la PPT, okay? Just a moment. Are you able to see what I'm checking right now, guys? Yes? Yes. Okay, excellent. All right, so let's repeat. My neighbor is playing soccer tomorrow. My neighbor, My neighbor is, is playing, playing soccer, tomorrow. soccer tomorrow. I am swimming right now. I am swimming right now. What are you doing these days? 
What are you doing these days? days? What are you doing these days? What are you doing these days? What are you doing these days? Excellent. People, people are cutting too many trees. People, People are, are, are cutting too many trees. I am uh, seeing my friend tomorrow. I am I'm seeing my friend tomorrow. tomorrow. Very, very good, very good. Give me one second. Let's see. All right, so let's repeat or let's complete this uh, exercise. All right, so it says like this, choose the correct response. All right, so what would be the answer? Letter A, my Hernandez, IT department, B. What would be the answer? I don't work here. Hello, this is Maria from accounting or nice to meet you. Hello, this is Maria from accounting. From accounting, right? Okay, very good. From accounting. I, okay, excellent. I like to report uh, a problem. L L se llama? Letter B, answer would be sure. Wait a minute. I am busy right now. What is the problem? What is the problem? What is the problem? What is the problem? All right. How can I help you? How can I help you? Number mm -hmm. one, number two, number three. Number one. Number one. I like to report a problem with my computer. Okay, very good. So what seems to be the problem, Mr. Campos? I have a headache. My computer doesn't run. My computer doesn't turn on. I don't remember. What would be the answer? My computer, my doesn't, computer turn doesn't turn on. Okay. It's a good reason to call tech support. My car doesn't start. There's no, there's no toilet paper. Funny noise. In the CPU, I mean, in the CPU, I'm sorry. All right, funny noise. In the CPU. Funny noise in the CPU. CPU, CPU. all right, so CPU. let's see. Excellent, 20 of 20s, all right, so excellent. Nice. Good job, guys. Let's see. All right, so now let me just let me check something else over <laughs> here. Okay, one second. Remember, remember, guys. In the meantime, uh, you need to complete all the exercises that we have, and remember that we need to be the two hours if we want to get the right, um, you know, percentage, right? So from our system. Okay, si queremos a completar la el porcentaje que nos requiere la academia tenemos que estar las dos horas verdad 160 uh, 120 minutos perdón okay so give me one second just a moment so we were checking unit three can you, are you able to see what I'm checking right now guys yes yes teacher okay excellent. yes Hold on one second. Unit two. Unit two, one second. Well, we, we're looking on unit three, all right? So, all right. So remember that we've been checking so far, pressing continuous, pressing progressive. All right, so ING, gerund, all right? So which is, Kind of like the same, but it's not the same, all right? So just keep in mind that situation, all right? So uh, as you can see, guys, over here, there's a exercise, or most likely a conversation between Peter and Henry, right? So as you can see, you are looking, or we can read, all right, information related to the topic that we've been checking so far, all right? In this case, would be, all right, hello, I mean, would be ING, Jerome, which is in this case uh, our present progressive, right? Or present uh, continuous, all right? So you need to identify when should be present progressive or present continuous as well. Pero como le dije anteriormente, ese punto no quiero que se, 
que se, se meta mucho ahí porque se va a confundir. Solo tengamos en mente que para poder hacer, salir adelante y, y entenderlo al paso que vamos, solo vamos a agregarle al verbo ing, ing, que es el endo en español, ¿verdad? O el ando, ando jugando, ando, ando. platicando, tomando, eh, saltando, etcétera, etcétera, etcétera. ¿verdad? En este caso sería lo, lo, lo mismo, pero en inglés, obvio. All right, so let's see. So, remember how to use present continuous for future events. Dice acá, ¿verdad? Dice, we use present continuous to talk about arrangements for events at the time later than now. The structure, subject, verb, uh, verb to be, main verb, gerund, que es el, ing, el ing, y el complemento. Y dice, I am meeting the interns tomorrow. This action will take place in the future. Tomorrow. Okay, esta acción va a tomar lugar eh, mañana. Okay, so, mm -hmm. el otro ejemplo dice, what time is Maria interviewing the people? She She is interviewing them at 5 p.m. Okay. Y la última es, dice, I am writing the report next week. Dice, nice. And I am sending it, and I'm sending it as soon as you, as soon as, as soon as you finish. Okay. So what it means, guys? ¿Qué quiere decir esto? We use present continuous to talk about arrangement for events at the time later than now. Okay. So. Do you have any questions so far, guys, about present continuous or present progressive? Any, alguna preguntita? No questions? All right, so let's see. No sé si ya contestaron esta parte de acá, esta de la unidad 3. Si ya la contestaron, dice next week, Mark, is what? ¿Cómo sería esta oración? ¿Cómo sería esa oración, guys? Yeah. Mark, Mark is, is sending the letters next week. The next. Mark yeah. is sending the letters next week, right? Very good. What about second? I mean, the third one. Jane is, Jane is working. working. Jane is, is working. Yeah. Jenny on the report tonight. On the, on the report tonight. All right, Jenny is working. I'm sorry, Jen. On, Jen, Jen, Jen is working on the report tonight. Excellent. Okay. So what about number four? Walter, the chair. Wal Walter, Walter is sending. Is sending the, the, the chair the the today. 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 Signing, uh, signing teacher. Signing, firmando. Mm -hmm. Walter is signing the Walter. checks today. Okay, Walter is signing the check today, right? Very good. Number five. What about number five? Any volunteer? Marina is organizing the presentation in the afternoon. Marina is organizing. Let's organizing. repeat. Organizing. 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 Marina is organizing the presentation, the presentation in the afternoon. In the afternoon. Excellent. In the afternoon. Excellent. What about number number six? Guillermo is going to the bank tomorrow. Excellent. 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 All right. So, you see, guys? Le ha puesto... Le ha puesto... No lo que sea, ¿verdad? Pero le apuesto mucho de que si usted se pone a practicar every day, every day, every day y se empapa de esto, uh, yo le pongo tal vez a lo mucho, si usted lo, si lo hiciera todos los días, que a los seis meses o antes, no, pues seis meses, ¿verdad? Y ya para pulirlo, pulirlo bien, un año usted ya está hablando inglés. Porque yo me doy cuenta que usted todo lo está entendiendo. O sea, la mayoría, yo sé que uh -huh. lo, lo entienden, pero, como le digo, si usted lo entiende, usted lo tiene que hablar. Pero no lo habla porque no lo practica. 
y quiero yo de que no se le vaya a pegar, ¿cómo se llama? Ese decir que muchas personas, o no sé si ya lo han escuchado ustedes, ¿verdad? Que dice, no, si yo le entiendo todo lo que él dice, todito le entiendo, pero si entiende lo que todito, el todito está diciendo el maestro de inglés, tendría que hablarlo, ¿verdad? Entonces, ¿pero por qué no lo habla? Sí, yo no, yo no dudo que no lo entienda, ¿por qué no lo habla? Porque no practicamos, ¿verdad? Anyways, very good, very good. I'm really proud of you guys. You are understanding everything about the topics that we are checking so far, okay? So let's see. All right, let's see. Be my guest, uh, Elmer and Jenny, please. Elmer, Jerry, Ryan, and Jenny, Raul. Go ahead. Okay. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am play, planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to, to your workplace? What is the first thing do you do? I usually arrive. Esa palabra me cuesta, teacher. Arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email and you. Well, I arrive at seven o'clock or seven thirty. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Excellent. Very good, very good. Let's repeat. Um uh, let's see. I heard something from Jenny. Let's see. Uh, oh. Okay, let's repeat everybody first. 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 Okay, very good. No first. fears. First. Mm -hmm. First. First. Okay, very good. Very good. First. Let's repeat activity. Activity. activity arrive arrive all right planning 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 r r am 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 is 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 okay excellent very good let's see uh carla and uh, william Good afternoon, Raúl. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador. What is would you what is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. Why, what time do you usually get to your workplace? What the first thing do, do you? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. and the first thing I do is check my email. And you? Will arrive at 7 o'clock or 7.30, it depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Thank you very much, uh, David and Jocelyn, please. Be my guest. Go ahead. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I, well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference, why the new team in San Salvador, why is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They're, they are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. Why time do you usually get to your workplace? What the fear, first thing you do? I usually arrive 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email and you. Wait, arrive at 7 or 7.30. In the pen of traffic, my first activity is to ping with the letter. With the letter. Thank you very much. Very good job. Let's see, uh, Joseph, Derek, and Claudia, please be my guest. Good afternoon. 
Raul, what are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan Will. I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with a new team in San Salvador? What is your team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are get up ready for the conference in the meet meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get up to your workplace? What what is the first thing you do? I usually arrive at six AM and the first thing I do is to check in my email and you. Hello, and you? Hoy le faltó más. ¿Quién, ¿Quién se quedó ahí? ¿O se terminó? Como que se fue, le, se le fue el audio. Sí, verdad. Bueno, sí. ok, very good, very good. Let's see. Uh, vamos a ver. Uh, vamos a ver. All right, uh, Daniel Armando, and let's see. And Elmer Antonio. Go ahead, Daniel. Okay. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I'm planning a video conference. Oh, the conference? Why the new thing in Salsa? In San Salvador, what is your thing dying right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I, I see. What time do you usually get? Do you do your workplace? What, what's their first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 o'clock or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letter. Excellent, excellent. Let's see. Uh, so, uh, David, are you there? Yes. Yes. Okay, David and quien no participado. Hi. David and Laura. Hi, hi, teacher. Oh, uh, va manejando todavía. No, ya, ya no. Okay, David and Laura, please be my guest. Go ahead. Um, good afternoon, Raúl. Where are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ray. Uh, way I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new thing in San Salvador. What is her? What is? Siempre me cuesta esa palabra, teacher. What is her they do right now? Yet yeah, it is they are they are getting getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see what I do you usually get at your workplace. What the first thing you do? I usually I usually arrive at six at six thirteen AM. And the and the first thing I do is to check my email and you. Well, I arrive at seven or seven or seven. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the up the letter. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay. Anybody else? Uh, ¿Todos participaron? ¿Quién no ha participado? Vamos a ver. Ay, ay, teacher. 
Yo Sobeida. Sobeida, Sobeida y quién más? Marvin. Y Marvin, ok, Mar go ahead. Marvin. Go ahead. Dele Marvin. Ok. Eh, good afternoon, Raúl. Good night, Raúl. Good afternoon, Ray. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, with the new day in San Salvador. What is all they doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. Okay. What I do you usually get to your work place? What is the first thing you do? I usually arrive at this thirty day. I am and the first thing I do is to check emails, my emails and you. Uh, well, I, ar I arrive at 7 or 7.3. It depends on trace of my freeze activity is to pick up the letter. Okay, excellent. Very good. Okay, so let's repeat 30, no 3, 30. Let's repeat 30. 30. Everybody, 30. 7.30. 7 7.30, 30. 30. yes. 30. Yes. Excellent. Se right. Excellent. So now let me ask you a quick question, guys. Uh, this question is for everybody. What do you see or which um, topic we are we are talking in this conversation? ¿Qué tema es el que se, el que, el que se está desarrollando en esta conversación? Tema de, de inglés, obvio, que estamos, lo que hemos estado practicando. ¿Qué tema sería? En esta conversación de, 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 de between Ryan and Raúl. Menciona que están planificando una un videoconferencia y que va a ser en San Salvador. Mm -hmm. Sí, no, no mi, mi pregunta es, tal vez no me, no me la no me expliqué bien. Ajá. Mi pregunta es, ¿qué tema es ah. el que se está desarrollando en esta conversación? ING. 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 Very good, very good, very good. Y si se fija, ah, pues de esa manera es como usted va a aplicar prácticamente su uh, ING topic en su daily activities o daily basis, ¿verdad? Cuando usted esté hablando, de esta manera usted lo va a aplicar, ¿verdad? Si usted se fija, ahí lo está, me lo está mencionando de la manera que tiene que ser, ¿verdad? Y de esa manera usted también lo va a aplicar. Usted dice, ok, es lo que quiero hablar y así lo voy a, a utilizar. Es lo único que yo quiero que tengan, no tal vez cuidado, ¿verdad? Pero que tengan o lo tomen en cuenta, ¿verdad? Para usted poder desarrollar bien la conversación, ¿ok? Anybody else want to participate? Anybody else want to participate? No, everybody. Everybody clear? Ok, let's go. Esto también creo que eh, se los se los pedí para la próxima, perdón, para el, para el portafolio, ¿verdad? Complete the sentences yes. in present continuous, all right? So usted tiene que saber eso. Ya lo verificamos, vamos a ver. So, a schedule events at the workplace. All right, so what is what is a schedule means? ¿Qué quiere decir schedule? Horario. Horarios, ¿verdad? All right, mm -hmm. horarios. Si usted se fija acá, pues, está un, están hablando acá de que what events are taking place at your workplace these days. Okay, so, ¿qué eventos van a suceder en el lugar de trabajo? ¿Verdad? Es lo que está preguntando acá. So, en este caso está Rose and Mary. Y le dice Rose a, a Mary, right? Le dice, hello, Mary. What are, you, what are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am signing some payrolls on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? That's okay. I am taking... I am... I'm sorry, that's okay. I am talking to 
uh, colleagues and checking reports and who is an analyzing the advances in the, in the company. Si me fijó, ¿verdad que se oye bien feo lo que acabo de decir? No se escuchó como pregunta, ¿verdad? Y es pregunta, imagínense. Entonces, por esa razón, uno siempre tiene que tener en cuenta cómo va a hablar, ¿verdad? Ya sea en español o en inglés, siempre tiene que sonar como pregunta cuando va a decir una pregunta. Y dice, and who is analyzing the advances in this company? ¿Verdad? Pero yo solo lo leí al principio, lo leí. Es, and who is analyzing the advances in, in the company? ¿Verdad? Se oye entre pregunta cortada y mal hecha, ¿verdad? Y entonces le dice Rose, Peter is, ¿ok? So, let's see. One second. All right, read this article about activities to keep uh, to keep employees happy. Discuss and the sentences below are true or false and correct the false ones. Okay, it says like this. Uh, organize yoga classes. Let's see. Um, Elmer, please read the first, I mean, the number one. Okay. If you work in an office and your employees are sitting at the computer every day, don't under, underestimate the impact yoga could have on their acti attitude and outlook. Yoga can help alleviate. How do you pronounce this word, teacher? Oh, you can, uh, yoga can help alleviate the stress. Alleviate the stress. Calm the mind, release tension, improve brain function, and lift mood. What boss would want those outcomes? Uh, uh, outcomes. Okay, let's see. Outcomes. Alleviate stress. Alleviate stress. Hmm? Alleviate stress. Alleviate stress. Repeat. Alleviate stress. Alleviate stress. It. Okay. Alleviate stress. Alleviate stress. All right. So, si se dio cuenta cómo saqué eso yo, ¿verdad? El mismo, el mismo sistema me lo dio, ¿verdad? Te le pasa acá. Perdón. Y mira, aquí me tiró la aplicación del traductor. ¿verdad? Usted le da clic al la cosita y le tira esto acá. All right. So, y ahora usted le da solo aquí. ¿verdad? Alleviate stress. Alleviate stress. Alleviate stress. stress. No, pero no es alleviate stress. No es alleviate. Vamos a ver. Mira. Anyways, okay, so usted ya sabe cómo sacarlo. Entonces, mm -hmm. let's see. Uh, Jenny, please uh, read the next one, number two. Uh, celebrate birthdays. Yes. Uh, you don't just have to really on business games to boost moral. Uh, Esa palabra, teacher. Well. Sim simple. Simply. Okay. ¿Dónde va? Dice, uh, you don't have, I mean, you, I mean, dice, you don't. En la segunda. Second line. Simply. Uh, uh -huh. Vamos a ver. Ahí esa palabra. No se preocupe, no se preocupe. Vamos a ver, espérese. A ver, permítame. Aquí. Se lo arreglamos de una sola manera, mire. Rapidito. Ok. You don't just have to rely on business games to boost morale. Simply acknowledging special occasions can have a big impact. It shows your team that you care about them as people, not just as employees. Get everyone to sign a card, have cake once a month, or simply buy them around. One more time. Otra vez. Yes? Yes. Okay. You don't just have to rely on business games to boost morale. Simply acknowledging special occasions can have a big impact. It shows your team that you care about them as people, not What's just as not employees. Problem? Get everyone to sign a card, have cake once a month, yeah. or simply buy them around. Yeah. 
Ay, sí, yo pensé que Tito, el... así. O sea... Tito, yo pensé que solo la palabra, Ticha. Oh, okay. No, 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 yo le puse todo para que este, también tenga la, usted la, la, la opción de pronunciar mejor las otras palabras, ¿ok? Ahorita se lo voy a poner. No, no se preocupe, no se preocupe. Vamos a ver. All right, go ahead. La palabra era, era el simple, right? Simple. Simply acknowledging. No, no, acknowledging. 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 Oh. Occasion. Occasion. Can have a big impact. Mm -hmm. It shows your team that you care about them as people, not just as employees mm -hmm. get everyone to sing a car have have K once a month or simply bite them around around around, around. Mm -hmm. of coffees each time someone in your team has a birthday thank you very much thank you so much uh William please next Paintball. Give your employees an opportunity to leave off some esteem by organizing a day of paintball. Simply getting out of the office can work wonders for staff morale. Watch how tall as the boss. You're going to be a prime target. Excellent. Let's see. Uh, number four. Uh, uh, David, please. Be my guess. A West who acts very as obey to bring uh, a chisboard pick como es la palabra de teacher I did sorry. Which which word? Eh plot es que la de foto. Uh which line? Dice as everyone to bring line. This is it. Ask everyone to bring a childhood photo of themselves. For, photo for, of themselves. Okay, mm -hmm. Photo of the texels uh, and and put them all up on the on a board and and then get and they get every to put their best west forward on each one. It's a bit. Of easy lay her her phone that with definitely help lift spirits way offering plating of humor allow this way. Excellent, very good, very good. Let's see, uh, Claudia, please number one. Organize yoga class. Is you work in the office and your employees are sitting on computer every day. Don't don't know on their system the impact yoga call have on their attitude and oplo. Yoga can keep a stress, calma timing, relax tension. Empowering brain function and live more what bus what want to outcomes. Okay, outcomes, right? Outcomes. 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 Okay, very good. Number two, let's see Marvin. Go ahead. Uh, number two. Yes, go ahead. Se, se, celebrity birthday. You don't use how to really own business again to wish morally simply actor with things, especially occasion can have a big impact. It should you think that you Okay, 
about being as people, not just is M players are have care one month or simply by the ring around. Okay. I guess we lost the Marvin. Okay, so let's see. Um so where... Oh, let's see. Jocelyn, are you there? Number three, please. Three. Uh, painful. Give your employer an opportunity to let off some esteem by organizing. In day of painful, simply getting out of the office can work wonders. For staff moral, what, what autos as the boss, you're going to be a prime target. Okay, excellent, very good. Let's see number number four. Uh, number four. Let's see, Laura, please go ahead. Uh, guess who. Yes. Has has every has everyone no this is everyone has every to ray a childhood photo of themselves and put them all up one aboard and then get everyone to put their best guesses. For what on each one, it is a bit of easy life, headed from that will definitely help life spirit while offering plenty of humor along the way. Very good, very good. Number, uh, let's see. Number one, um, teacher, eso está como que son un montón de palabras que casi uno nunca escucha y quizás por eso cuesta. No, por eso, no, es que esa es, 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 es la idea, es la idea de que usted pronuncie como ahorita se le permite, si lo dice bueno, lo dice malo, lo dice más o menos. Está se malísimo. Per, se, le permit, se le permite, se le permite, no se preocupe, no se preocupe. Lo que estamos haciendo ahorita es desenrollando la lengüita como la tenemos bien enrolladita, ¿verdad? Está bien tremenda, estamos desarrollando prácticamente la estrategia o la técnica que yo les dije la vez pasada, ¿verdad? Le, estamos eh, repitiendo palabras que primero tal vez no sabemos el significado, segundo no sabemos la pronunciación, ¿verdad? Pero si usted continúa este, este ejercicio, este ejercicio, este ejercicio como le digo, todos los días todos los días se le va a hacer fácil, fácil, fácil. Créamelo, créamelo, créamelo que después usted va a decir, tenía razón, tenía razón el, el coach, ¿verdad? Ok, let's see. Uh, just said Derek, ¿ya participó? No, teacher. Ok, number, number one. Organize yoga classes. If you work in an office and your employees are sitting at computers every day, don't underestimate it, the impact Yoga call have on their attitude and outlook. Yoga can help everybody stretch, calm the mind, release tension, improve brain function and lift mood. What was well done? What does outcome? Okay. Very good, very good. Laura, please, number two. Ce celebrate birthdays. You don't just have to reel on business game to boost morally. Simply ask. Uh, how do you say? Esa palabra, no sé cómo. Acknowledging. Oh, acknowledging. Acknowledging. 
Acknowledging. Simply acknowledging, yes. Special, Simple yes. Acknowledging special occasions. They have a big impact. Is show you thing that you care about them as people, not just as employers. Get everyone to sing a care. How okay once a month on simple by thing around. Excellent, very good. Let's see. Um I mean, uh let's see. Thank you so much. Mario Roberto, are you there? Yes, teacher. Go ahead, number three. Uh, number three, please. Number three, okay. Uh, give your employees an opportunity to let off, to let off some esteem by organizing a day of paintball. Simply, simple getting out of the office and can work can work wonders for staff model more, more, more. watch out thoughts as the boss you you're going to be part a prime target okay very good very good number uh number four let's see who else uh will oh, william no sé si ya, ya, ya pasó usted. Yes. Okay, okay, let's see. ¿Quién no ha participado? Ya, yeah, teacher. Andrea. Go ahead, Andrea. Number four. Guess who has ever joined to bright a child photo of themselves and put, put them all up on a board and they get ever joined to put their best Guessest forward on each one. It's a bit of AC, like hers, fun that will define define life, help life spirit. We are while offering plenty of humor along the way. Very good, very, very good, very good. Let's see. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, I guess, like, uh, sometimes we don't like to practice, right? We don't like to mention some words. Yo sé lo que, lo que, lo que se siente estar practique, 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 practique. Pero si no practicamos, no vamos a aprender, okay? So, today I just put away the games, all right? So, bueno, este día puse los juegos a un lado. Pero no quiere decir que no vamos, a, no vamos a jugar porque a veces eso le despierta a uno la inquietud y la manera de, 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 la manera de aprender en una, mejor, en una mejor opción, ¿verdad? Porque este, sí, le despierta a usted bastante, bastante información cuando usted está adivinando o está eligiendo o está opinando respecto a los juegos. All right, so nuevamente le repito... Eh, le sugiero que este, me completen lo que son los ejercicios de la plataforma. Eh, quiero ver qué más, que me complete más que todo eh, la asistencia. Acuérdense que ahí mandaron ahora un mensaje, eh, se lo mandó ahí nuestra compañera coordinadora y ella pues está tratando de, de, de colaborar y ayudarles a ustedes lo, en lo más que se pueda. Pero si ustedes no se ayudan, creo yo de que ella no, le, no les va a echar la mano en ese caso sí. Si, si así se podría decir o hablar, ¿verdad? Entonces, I want you to you guys complete the activities. Remember, if you can complete the portfolio exercises, do it. But if you if you don't want it, don't do that, all right? So this is just for you convenience, all right? Eso es para su conveniencia. If you want to complete the exercises, do it and send it uh, to me uh, como un archivo PDF, all right? So, and that would be it. All right, eso va a ser todo. No sé si tienen alguna pregunta. So far, guys, ya son las... ¿Qué horas tienen ustedes? Me faltan, me faltan 20 minutos para las 10. Media hora me falta. <laughs> solo, solo, solo vi la, la, la cara de, 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 de David y de Jenny y de Just Derek. ¿Cómo le hicieron así? ¿Cómo le hicieron así? 20 minutes. 20 minutes. ¿Estás serio? Are you talking about 20 minutes, Mr. Escamilla? 
25 minutes, all right? So, any questions so far, guys? ¿Quiénes no, no, ¿quiénes no, no tienen cuesta. la... Very good. ¿Quiénes no tienen la, los documentos que yo les he dado? O sea, los que yo he subido. Ahí. ¿Todos lo tienen teacher. ya, verdad? No, yo, teacher. Va, entonces yo ahí lo voy a, lo voy a volver a reenviar y, y eso, para es que, que los tengan. No, no estoy agregado al, 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 al grupo, creo, de WhatsApp, teacher. Oh, y es que está no. ocupado ya, ¿eh? ¿Y por qué no acá? Pero es que eso ya lo hubiera, lo hubiera, lo hubiera verificado ya con, con algún coordinador, mi estimado. Porque yo, no, la verdad, yo no en ese caso yo no puedo... Okay. Sí, okay. hacer nada, pero le debería escribir por aparte okay. al, al okay, coordinador mira. de acuerdo, de acuerdo. Ajá, que le, ellos, ellos lo agreguen ¿verdad? Sí. mañana voy a hacer eso very good, very good, ok guys nice is nice, ok, so I see you tomorrow, thank you so much for your time and, ha and have a wonderful rest of the night, ok, so sleep good y descanse y si va a tomar café, usted se entiende okay. que no va a poder dormir, ok very good Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Good night, guys. Good night, guys. Good night, night. 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 Jenny. Bye, bye. Good night. 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 Good